everyone, it's Tiffany. I am here with the Zuru Mini Brands Create Garden. Oh, oh my gosh, this is going to be so fun. There's a little example of some flowers and an arrangement there. It says create your own cute mini garden. And I must find out what we can find in here. I wonder if it's going to be all flowers or if there'll be bad days or what. But we have three of these to open up today. So let's go ahead and get started. Beyond excited. All right, first layer is off, and then the next layer is just a green layer, no pattern or anything on it. Okay, here we go. The moment we've been waiting for. All right, we've got all of our goodies wrapped up in blind bags, and then here is the checklist. All right, so let's look at this little bit by little bit. Now we've got the scented ones that are ultra rare. Those look cute. Look at the little butterflies. Oh, some of these have butterflies in the common too. Okay, so common, we're seeing cacti, succulents, and flowers mostly. Um, and then over, oh wait, wait, wait. Oh wait, what? Maybe these are, okay, so it says the blue circle's ultra rare and the green one's common. Okay, I see down here. I was just gonna say, they're not, they're not next to them. Anyway, ultra rare and then these are the commons. Is there more? No. All right, so it is mostly houseplant based, I guess we can say. I'm pretty excited for the flower arrangements, like the little daffodils here. And these kind of look like, there's a few different flowers that could be. This looks like, um, I'm also blanking on that, but we have like an orchid and we have some like lily of the valley perhaps, roses, lots of fun ones and the succulents are cool too. But let's go ahead and see what, what's up, what we got. All right, first up we have, not sure, dirt, I guess, maybe. Um, let's just open up all of it and then we'll kind of put it together. I think there's like an instruction thing on the, like a, a recipe card essentially on the back of this, but I didn't want to spoil what one I got. All right, it looks like I got one of the mixed plants ones. Let's see, like one of these. And it's so much bigger than I thought it was going to be. I thought it was going to be small. Yeah, no, it's not going to be small. All right. So here are all of our goodies. Okay. And we had to turn it around here. So... First, we'll go step by step here. So first we get this orange pot with this dirt and we put the dirt in. Does it go in a certain way? No, not really. Put the dirt in like that. I like how it all snaps together. This is fun. And then I think this is an aloe. Oh no, this is just the bottom of a cactus. Okay, so it's a triangle shape and we gotta put it in. Really? I don't think it fits in there. <laughs> Maybe this is the one for here. Yeah, 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 this is it. Okay, I see it now. Wait, what? I didn't get that many pots though. Wait, what? Is this just like an extra? Now I'm confused. Oh, it's the surprise succulent. Okay, okay, I see. It says succulent, surprise succulent. Um, I guess you just like get whatever one fits. Okay, and then we're moving on to this recipe, which we'll put this dirt in. Honestly, kind of like how this is like clean. I didn't need to use any, any like dirt, actual dirt <laughs> um, or sand or anything. And then you just kind of like got to match up the little pieces here. All right. I like this. And then if you really wanted this to be more permanent, you could totally glue it in. Uh, I'm just gonna, I might come back and glue these in. We shall see. But this is really cool. Quite like this. And then, you know, you got the top for your little cactus. Go ahead and put this in the, this is so cute. I'm just gonna put this on my windowsill. Actually, maybe not because my cats will probably take it. <laughs> but it'd be really cute on a little bookshelf or a little window area. I really, really do love this. Um, I think, oh, there are four holes. I was like, oh, we got four of these and we only have three holes. No, we're good. All right, so you can kind of move these, like twist them to kind of fit however you'd want them to fit, I guess, like that. Okay, and then we have one more little guy here. This is cool. We got this little thing too, but we don't like actually need it. This is cute. This is not what I expected out of this, this series, but I'm here for it. These are all like little plastic plants. It's just so cool. I just love, uh, like I said, I thought they were gonna be much smaller, but now it's growing on me and I quite like this and it's gonna be for, good for a little display piece. 
All right, so that was our first one. Now I'm very excited. I can't wait to see what the next one's gonna be. I quite, I quite like the mixed plant one. I just, I feel like I got a lot out of that. I definitely want to see one of the bouquet ones, the flower arrangement ones. I'm not sure which one I prefer. Maybe I like the butterfly. Although I did like that yellow one that I didn't really know what flower it was. Anyway, oh, it looks like we've got some magic glue for this one. So that makes me think it might be a flower arrangement because I'm not sure. The other ones, like the other succulents, would have. Oh, we do have a cactus. Okay. Um. Right. 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 What is this? I don't know, but we got a little shovel. Oh, that was our surprise succulent, of course. Oh. Oh. Okay. Interesting. So let me get. I keep forgetting we get a surprise succulent with with everyone. Let me put this out. So this is the one we got. And I'm gonna do the surprise succulent first. So we'll just go ahead and, wait, is this the dirt? That's not the dirt, <laughs> whoops, my bad. All right, put that in there. And then where'd the succulent go? Here he is, right here. And then we've got the little tops with a little cactus, super cute. I love the little surprise. Okay, so now let's look at this, these instructions. So we wanna put this in first, this dirt. Then we need to put the little flowers on all of these sticks, which is a little tedious. But can I just say, I'm not even sure what material these are because I think it's like fabric flowers, like fake flowers. So if you go to the craft store or whatever, you can go pick up some fake flowers. That's exactly what it is. But I thought at first it felt a little bit more like hard plastic, so I wasn't sure. But anyway, um, let's see here. You can kind of have them all go different ways. I'm gonna try to make mine go the same way, like that. And wait, how many flowers are supposed to go on here? Just six, I think so. All right, so let's go boom. And then I'm trying to make them, I'm gonna come back and make them go the same way. Let me turn this upside down. And then get another one. So it looks like we're getting extra unless, oh no, 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 there's another stick. Okay, I was gonna say. All right, so that's our first stick of flowers. This is so cute. Oh my gosh, there's a ladybug. <gasps> oh my gosh, okay. Sorry, <laughs> I'm getting a little too excited here. This is, this is my favorite little craft. I love this. Now this glue that we got is a UV glue. So to make it cure, you're gonna wanna put it outside in the sunshine for five to 10 minutes, or if you have a UV lamp or flashlight, that works as well. I have a light here that I'm gonna bring in to help us, but really we only use it for the ladybug. Uh, so you could use actual glue or whatever you wanna do. All right, so next we're going to put this bottom part on these little leaves. And then I guess we just go ahead and put these in here like this. We can have them go different ways. Oh my God. <laughs> I love it. And then you could kind of twist it too so that they're not like completely even. The, the, these things aren't completely even. The leaves, well, look at that. Oh, you can't really see it, sorry. Look at that, it's so cute. It's too tall for the camera. Let me, let me uh, move it up just a tad bit there. And then we do have this shovel, right? But the glue, let's take a look at it. So it's probably sealed here, yep. All right, I'm gonna open that up and then I'll put this back on. So, oops, there we go. Now we need to put this little ladybug on. I don't know where I want her. I almost want, I guess we'll put her on the leaf there. That's really cute. So let me put a little dollop. I don't wanna put too much on. Whoop, I went and put too much on. I <laughs> put way too much on. Let me, uh, um, hold on. <laughs> I'm gonna get a little, little napkin here because I definitely don't wanna overdo it here. Honestly, I could put her, let's, let's just wipe it off and try again. <laughs> try again. <laughs> All right, I'll just put like, I literally just need the tiniest dollop like that. And then we'll put her on there and kind of get her positioned right where we want her. 
And then I have my light here. We bring it in and then we'll cure her on there. Wonderful. All right, so we'll let that sit while we kind of clean up a little bit and open up the next one, perhaps. This is so fun. I'm so hyped. All right, I'm gonna put my mini succulent back there. I'm actually gonna kind of move this also back here so that that can cure. Oops, sorry, mini succulent. All right, I really, really do want to find one of the floral arrangements in the vase. That is probably the one I want the most next, any of them. I will, oh my gosh, I thought that was going all the way and knocking everything over. Um, but yeah, I'll take any of them because that's kind of like the only different one. I mean, there's like a little bonsai tree and stuff, but um, different as in like what materials we get and all that stuff. This is kind of heavy. I wonder if we got another um, one like that with lots of different ones. Let's see. This is our surprise succulent. So I got I got it down now. I know what <laughs> what's happening. This is cute though. I'm glad we got this one. We got a different color. This one's awesome. I love this one. All right. Let's see what we have. All right. I see a cactus piece. And oh man, we got lots of cacti actually. Quite a few. Wow. All right. Um, let me get the instructions out just to make sure I do this properly. All right. So we have our pot and we'll put that with or the dirt inside the pot and press down. Then we're going to take this guy and put these guys on top. <laughs> Perfect. Yes. Then we put this guy in here. We just got to find the, the little thing that matches up with him. Yep, and then we put this guy in next. I think he goes here. Yes, yep. And then we go for this guy. Actually, wait. No, I gotta put him together. I was gonna say, that does not line up. <laughs> um, I think, do we just like, just put them together like this? I guess so. And then they go in here. Let me see if I can do this right. All right. Yep. There we go. And then last but not least, we've got our other one. Oh my goodness. So cool. And then we got a shovel with this one as well. So we got a shovel with the last one, a shovel with this one. But this has a little bit of a messed up paint job right there, but honestly, so cool. I don't know. This is, this is like tough to kind of pick a favorite, but um, let me check on our ladybug. It looks like she's set. So that's the final there. I don't know. Oh my gosh. I have to pick a favorite now. This is going to be tough. But these are all of the ones that we unboxed today. Let me move my light out of the way. But I think I really want to say the flowers are my favorite. But I also really like this one with all of the different plants in it. I think I am going to choose the flowers though. Because I do love the ladybug. I love the flowers. How they're actual like fake flowers. You know they're not just plastic. Pe I mean... They're plastic because they're fake flowers, but they're, they're like flexible. You know what I mean? They're different material. Anyway, let me know your favorite out of these three that we got today. I want to thank you guys so much for watching. Be sure to subscribe and I will see you next time.